Alright, how's it going guys and welcome back to more WW2K22 My Rise. And yeah guys, in the last video we fought Karrion Cross, managed to keep, it was a great match, we managed to retain our NXT North American title. Then we had a match with Chase, he was trying to get an NXT contract, he never got signed but it was actually a really good match, I really enjoyed it. And then we went in a feud with Cameron Grimes, he said he was the greatest wrestler, he wore a hat and that's how this feud started. And then Jeff Hardy got involved, top heel on us, yeah, Cameron Grimes in a fight, Jeff Hardy. He was going to hit us with a baseball bat. Jeff Hardy took the baseball bat off Graves and hurt me. And do so new. It's going to be a two and two TLC match. That is going to be amazing. We don't know who our mystery partner is yet, but I'm loving this heel Jeff Hardy. I wish we got kind of married this, but I'm loving this game, guys. Love you all. Let's do it. I know who my partner is, guys. Look who's here! Oh my God, Dexter Loomis. The following That's what you meant by Maniac. Is a tag team tables, ladders, and chairs match. And. At a combined weight of 467 pounds, Mr. Scott and Dexter Loomis. So much has changed for this superstar since he completed his training with Booker T. A former indie competitor, he left Houston a new athlete and set course full steam ahead for WWE. Oh, it's Jeff Hardy coming up with normal words. I love Jeff Hardy. Brace yourselves for the charismatic enigma. And their opponents first from Cameron, North Carolina. Weighing in at 225 pounds, Jeff Hardy! Byron, you can ask any superstar on the roster. It is next to impossible to prepare for the reckless abandon that Jeff Hardy manifests. You're absolutely right. We've learned over the years that Jeff Hardy will do absolutely anything. Jeff Hardy will take any risk available as long as it ends in a win. That We've seen Jeff Let's Hardy in plenty of TLC matches, but this is his first alongside his little brother, Cameron Grimes. You have to think Hardy's TLC experience gives him an edge here tonight. No way! Oh, I'm just completely off target there. Oh my god, I just fucking overshot that. Uncalculated risk. And I have no doubt they're going to pay dearly for it. Sit straight into the barricade. Great counter! And a big boot! Power from the suplex! And Tagiri finds its mark. Sent hard to the outside. Oh no! The superstar picking up speed on the outside! Wrecking ball! Drop kick! Just a devil may care attitude on full display. Going for broke. This match is going to be. A, I guess match going to be great. Oh Not man! Much. And Zagiri drops him, and Jeff not backing down. One Dexter. Drop with a suplex. He reverses it. He takes hold, and there's the Yurinagi. Landed them. Solid punch. Suplex. Oh, suplex. Driving the face down. Fucking hell. That'll hurt. DDT. Just counter after counter. Turning the tables. He'll take things into the ring. Heading back to the ring. Big time. Oh, foot just stomping down. 
Looking for his feet, Jeff Holden. Right to the leg. That unraveled on Grimes. Oh, he's getting a little battered now. Yeah, I don't like when we're all clustered up. Nice amateur takedown. All the way over. This is just brute power. Release German. He's going for it all. Sky high. All the way to the outside. Just crashing down with high impact. Oh, Swanton. She has a two and one. Single arm back. What next up? That takes power. Oh, man. Ouch. Fuck you, you. Whoa, not quite yet. And he goes into the ring. Coming back into the ring. Back to the action. The WWE Universe is pouring more fuel on his fire right now. Saw it coming and got out of there. Solid connection. Thanks, look at his stomp fucking egg with the crowd and actually hey, help me. He's on his heels a bit now. There's a reason TLC doesn't stand for tender loving care here in WWE. Oh, boom, right to the body. Strong oh. kick. My goodness. That is just insulting. Into Gary! Hardy takes the offensive. Just muscle. Fuck it, yeah, he'll destroy it, isn't he? Into the. And he's able to reverse. Quick exchange of counters there. Turned that one around. Renagi! Uranagi! He saw it coming, taking advantage. It's that time. The pin drop. Will Grimes recover? Cover. Two count. Yeah, no. He oh, he kicked her. He just won't Ooh. give up. He's absorbing some tough hits now. Would you come into a TLC match expecting anything less, Cole? There he goes, right into the corner. Oh, he's got him in deep, deep trouble here. Oh, look out. Oh, 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 no, Slight no, 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 no. shot right across the back of the neck. Ouch. Setting foot in the ring now. With a loss to the end of the table. What the hell, Tracy? He's got a plan for that table, and it does not involve... What the fuck is that guy doing? Nice backbreaker. Big forearm. No, 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 that'll break his arm. It's fuck, you know. Ooh, what a damaging blow. And Tagiri finds his mark. Systematic attack on that arm. He turns it around on Loomis. Oh, propelled into the table. Oh, we it. There we go, fuck it out. Why is this no walking? Oh my fucking god! Quick return to the ring. Elusiveness from It's just the walking! Back and forth from these competitors. And a leg drop for good measure. Fuck this table! Finds its mark. Bet him, bet him. This is slam and looking for the submission. Oh, this is there just we go. terrible to watch. It's over. So much pain and can't do anything. Grabs it. And the about the laser. Here are your winners, Mr. Scott and Dexter Loomis. Two sure, Dexter Loomis looked at and it was over. He's done with the show. Tag team excellence in its purest form. You simply love to see it. And I hope we see these guys tagging again real soon. The matter is complete. Now that you defeated, I was a while ago. Now you defeated Karrion Cross. How do you handle the alteration he made to your North American Championship? He's in the past now, so I want my original design. 
I understand I'll get you a new belt ASAP. I know. Wait, I have a very interesting message from Adam Pierce. Can you contact me to propose a trade? For, uh, trade you for future considerations. Vague, right? I thought I'd ask your opinion. No, I don't want to leave NXT yet, no. I have annoying favour to ask. Finn Balor is demanding an NXT North American match. And is threatening to walk out unless it happens. Honestly, I don't have the bandwidth right now. Can you help me out and defend your championship? Absolutely, let's do it. As against Finn Balor. If it's annoying, don't worry about it. Set up the match. I'll shut Finn Balor up. Thanks, I appreciate it. Since you're doing me a solid, I'll pick the match type. No submission. Falls count anywhere. Being GM is hard. Let's do it. The following contest is a Falls Count Anywhere match and is for the NXT North American Championship. Hey, my belt's back to normal. Can I like that walk? It means we all in Austin used to do it. Champ comes into his title defense incredibly confident, Corey. And with good reason, Cole. When you're the champ, you don't have to worry about winning. You just have to make sure you don't lose. That is the champion's advantage. The champ just know why I'm coming his first biggest challenge second. yet. Now, can he rise to meet the challenge? Champion who has truly reinvented himself. Isn't he NXT World Champion? Maybe a host of it, I'm not sure. Defense. Introducing the challenger from Bray County, Wicklow, Ireland, weighing in at 190 pounds, Finn Balor. And introducing the champion from Glasgow, Scotland, weighing in at 228 pounds, he is the NXT North American champion, Mr. Scott. He spent the belt. Always a big fight feel with the NXT North American title is being defended. And the NXT North American title stole the show in its inaugural ladder match and attempt to retain more coveted in the years. No, it's going to be hard. Introduction. Well, it's easy to see why, Michael. NXT has some of the fiercest competitors in the world, and uh, Will Barrow into the inside cradle for the win. Looking to steal one there, perhaps. Not even close. Imagine I go that, but that'd be. Oh my God! The springboard attack fails to land. Ref, kid, I can't just stop there because of the ref getting away. Kick lands. Finn Balor to the top rope. Half kick right on point. 
Enziguri finds its mark. And Finn heads him off at the pass. DDT plants them. Yeah, I can tell this oh, is going to be fucking hurt. very difficult. Point of the elbow, nailed it. He skirts and I am being tenated. Oh! oh! That is reckless abandon being shown. And paying off as well. Oh, no. Oh, stop right to the gut. Jumping double stomp. The champ getting put on the back foot here. Balor is gaining control here. Finn's at full throttle. Fishing for something beneath the ring. A steel chair? Something we all know can be a devastating weapon. He was waiting for him to make his move. Running Hurricane Rana. I can't know if you can go backstage. I don't think you can. Oh, stomp it away. And Balor's attack gets cut off. This is heavy kill fight up the stage. I'm actually going to fall up the stage. And Tagiri finds its mark. Nice calf kick. Great elevation. Caught by the there we go. Curry. Balor having trouble shifting the tides. Finn Balor's under the gun. German! Just pure dominance. Drop kick. Beautiful. Can I see if you can throw him off the stage? I'll do like a Shane McMahon and climb up, that would be amazing. I don't think you can. You should be able to jump off the stage. Oh my god, you can. Balor retaliates. I had that well scouted. That might be what gets him out of jeopardy. And the unabated offense continues. He's got to boost up his levels of aggression at this point. Boom. DDT! Goes into the pin. There's two! Ooh. Balor finds a way to stay in this. Not yet. What the hell? All the jumping, spinning heel kick. Who right was that? Point. This is game still has a better. I mean, still as bad as it was 20, but. Balor setting up! Now that'll do some serious damage. This game may have actually Enough just screwed already. me, yeah? Oh, there's a response against Finn. And Zagiri finds its mark. Sucks through. Up and over, Selena Del Sol. So off into the pen. He powers out at the oh. last moment. If the Selena ref was only in better position, that would have been three. He's got Finn entangled. Stunner! Stunner! Can it be? Will the rain continue? Ref. Cover! Two! Kick out. Fuck me ever. Simply refusing to let this opportunity slip away. And who knows if there'll be another shot. Yet you can't give up now. When your opponent can hang after all that, you're wondering if earning a win might just be impossible. Hits him with the counter. Series of reversals. Turning the tables there. Running Hurricane Rana. Fantastic. For the win to retain the championship! Oh, and the Ooh. last second with the title up for grabs. He kicked out! He actually kicked out! Ooh. 
Sometimes that's that not what I'm planning to do. Why are you doing? Half the things I tried to do, I was trying to get up back on the stage. STO! I'm a sex STO, I'm not gonna lie. Oh man, right to the R. Hyper extend your elbow. He's turning the tables. Oh my god, this game. Finn turns it around. Saw it coming. Oh no! Oh my, my god! God, that does it! That'll do it! Leaping off the stage to hit the mark, dead on! Can't quite get him there. A running Hurricane Rana. Going for it again! Wow. Oh, that was a sexy but move! Come on, that's going to be it! What match? Here is your winner, and still NXT North American Champion, Mr. Scott. The WWE Universe celebrating this match and the winner. With that win, they deserve the praise. Is there a club for losers Finn Balor can join after that performance? Yeah, the Sax Club. The sax club the sound of that sounded a bit weird. <laughs> Still champion guys. Being GM is hard. That was most of these hards are fought. I've had worse matches than that. Like an impressive and decisive NXT North American Championship defense from Mr. Scott Simon. And rumour has it a victory that won some goodwill backstage too. Fair enough. As far as gonna lead to something. There. And Cameron Grimes, I've never seen him. Okay, fine, you had to resort to getting that creep Dexter Loomis to help you, but I tipped my mind and cap to you, Mr. Scott Seven. My magnificent cap. Yeah, he took a good defeat, well, fair play to him. Let's have a look at the DMs. Uh, I probably, probably much answered that one. Let's have a look at the story progress, have you got anything left? Which... I don't want to leave yet. I think, um, I think at some point I'm going to turn heel and do all the heel stuff as well, so I've got a lot... A time stuck on NXT still today. Yeah, look, Finn Balor's still NXT champion, by the way. Why was that not a title versus title match? I totally won both. Right, let's go to locations. Yeah, last time we were here, we didn't actually talk to William Regal. We ended up just talking to Chase. Let's head to the GM's office. It's Cody Klein. Let's talk to William Regal. I'm not sure if you've heard. But Finn Balor is now the longest reigning NXT champion of all time. Wow. Yeah, I know. And it's not hard to be a record breaking champion when your contract says all your title defenses must have a five minute time limit. But remind me again who allowed that to happen. I regret letting that slip through the cracks, but I'm trying to fix it, which is why I wanted to talk to you. Are you giving me an NXT title opportunity? I wouldn't say giving. Because of Finn's unique time limit stipulation, I'll only choose his next challenger if they can first prove that they can beat another top opponent in under five minutes. I do not like where this is gone. Sort of like a tryout match, huh? Something like that. So, what do you think? Do you want to give this a shot or no? Yes, yeah, does. Someone has to put an end to this, and I want to be the one who does. Splendid. I'll line up your opponent for the five-minute trial run. Let's see what you can do. Demons and monsters, let's do it. Hold on. Did you know that the Prince of Bar is now the longest reigning NXT champion in history? Who, if anyone can defeat him? Nobody, the Prince will reign forever. You forgot the asterisk of not having the guts to face anyone longer than five minutes. Five minutes of my time is all the WWE Universe deserves. I'm lucky to even get that. So this is heel fin ball. Love heel fin ball. They deserve more. Like a champion who defends the NXT title with honour actual matches. And that champion is going to be me. Your reign is about to end. Okay. I like a winky face. I can't really see that emoji. Anyway.
See, that's what I don't like about this. If you're not defending your belt, just the don't show you. Hey, that on. One ball, making his way to the ring from Glasgow, Scotland, weighing in at 228 pounds, Mr. Scott. This former indie star learned the hard way that success in the ring yesterday doesn't guarantee glory the next. Respect must be earned. And he got a PhD in respect thanks to training with Booker T. If you test the two-time WWE Hall of Famer and five-time WCW champion, you're definitely... Okay, that's who I'm facing. I don't know who that is. Can I see? Wow, feast your eyes. I don't want to this guy, you know, feel tight. Ready to stomp out the opposition. And his opponent from Kingsboro, Massachusetts, weighing in at 270 pounds. Dominic Dijakovic. Yeah, I remember facing this guy a couple of videos ago. Every second counts tonight in this five-minute trial match turn an NXT Championship opportunity. William Regal's hand-picked candidate isn't just fighting Dominic Dijakovic. He's fighting Finn Balor's clock. Every night in NXT is a fight against the clock, Saxton. You never know how much time you have to make it to the top. That guy is fucking tall, by the way. I forgot how tall this guy is. Running Hurricane Rana! I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Soaring. Nobody home. I, I, I think I made contact, but no much. He went right into that turnbuckle. Don't focus on the clock. That can uh -oh. be people in five minutes. Face first in the turnbuckle. Up and over. Nice landing. Back in. Oh, wow. fuck. I know that. What an elbow. How resourceful. Ooh. This hasn't been a good start. What the heck? That's not supposed to happen. Of course it's not, Cole. That's... Nice crucifix into the pinfall. No! Counter! And multiple counters! Holy moly! And easily kicks out of the count. These men knew this match was going to be hard fought. Vicious right forearm. DDT! Climbing to the top rope. Look out! Shooting star press! What oh, a sexy shooting star press. Oh my god, the moonsault! Took a gamble once, took a gamble again, and hit the jackpot twice. Oh, costly error there. One eye in the clock, and guys. Here he finds its mark. And Dijakovic's in a state of distress. Yeah, Dijakovic needs to gauge the situation better than he is. Renagi. Tight spot for Dijakovic here. Dragon oh, please don't tell me because of the ropes. Dijakovic's night. No! Been officiating there. Referee seeing him the ropes and breaking the count. Cover. And he fights it off. He just won't give up. His offense is on point right now. Just producing an onslaught. There's a wheelbarrow into the DDT. Let's take the fucking team, man. Two count and still in this. Good lord, scarily close to three. Drop Rada. kicked all the way to the floor. Oh, wow, did you see that? That's finding any which way to topple the competition. Well, my guys, two own minutes one. Like that is insane. He's in under the ropes. Up the turnbuckles. What's he got? Up high. Shooting star press. Is it enough? The cover. Oh, and a kick out. How does anyone kick out at this point? Oh, he countered that. Are you kidding me, Odd? Dijakovic finds a counter. Vicious right forearm. Oh, he's got him here. He's got him up. And oh! 
Nice calf kick. Great elevation. Top rope, putting it all on the line. From way up, double axe handle. Taking flight. Shooting star press. Consecutive high-risk maneuvers, and the pace on, of this match has certainly picked up. Springboard moonsault. Wow. You have got to be kidding me. Using your body and muscle over and over again. I was pulling this a bit close. It's that time. A pick drop. This could be the chance he was looking for. Two. 41 seconds to spare. Oh, and a nice work. Whew. I didn't think I was going to do that. Here is your winner, Mr. Scott. What an emphatic victory, guys. No contest. That's why they call it light work, Cole. Barely even broke a sweat. I did. <laughs> I was like saying to myself, I was like, see what I go to like, the minute 20 mark. I'm going to end this one. Especially after you count up my, uh, my finisher. Hey, uh, I definitely know this man. Hey, William Regal, that was an impressive enough to earn an NXT Championship match against Finn Balor. You proved you have what it takes possibly to defeat Finn Balor under his rules, so it's official. You're next in line for the WWE NXT Championship. Oh, guys, I can have both belts in NXT. Both single belts, anyway. Possibly. Solid endorsement from the NXT GM. Hey, William Regal was one of the greats. Absolute brilliant wrestler, William Regal was. If I gave up every time I faced long odds, I wouldn't be here today. I've overcome them and I'll do it again. How about we increase the odds with a training match where you attempt to win in under five minutes? The more preparation, the better. That's cute. Let me know when the training needs... Training wheels come off and you're ready to do the real thing. Hmm. I'm ready then, eh? Yeah, well, I was trying to read that there on my, my telly jump, so that's why, that's why I couldn't say wheels. Uh, you see this, make sure the wheels come off. I'm, I'm fucking ready, Finn Balor. You've seen this? That was kind of like a training match, so what is this? Oh, come on, please don't tell me it's working wild again. Mendoza is here. Hey, an impressive talent with a bit of an attitude. He was the guy I made my Ryan NXT debut against me, all of those videos ago. And his opponent. Representing Legado del Fantasma from Cordoba, Veracruz, Mexico. I just really like it. This one. Being a WWE superstar requires a lot of physical talent, but a nights like this and a no disqualification match, it's clear that creativity and imagination are equally important. Oh, there's no doubt about it, Michael. If you can imagine a weapon, see an object, or recruit an ally, you can change the course of this match in a heartbeat. If you can dream it, you can do it. So we'll see who can dream the biggest here. There's a wheelbarrow. DDT. To the DDT. Sky high. Shootings. Oh, wait, what the fuck? We have company. It's the NXT champion, Finn Balor, here to scout his future opponent. Where is he? Yeah, but where is he? Playing mind games, I guess. Finn's behind him! Look out! Balor with 1916! The cover! Stops the count before it too. And those kickouts are only gonna get harder. I need to hurry up, man, because I've got his table. Able to parry that one. A running Hurricane Rana. Beautiful. From way up, diving double axe handle. There's a wheelbarrow. Boom, DDT. And for some reason, he stops the count. Yeah, I don't think I was going to get it. It's way too soon. Oh, man. Stomping down. Oh, what a kick. Oh, he can't look that. Mendoza answers back. Take down. 
Standing shooting star press. Incredible. Well scattered yes. reversal there. Incoming. He heads outside. Count out's legal in this match. Can't quite get him there. From the top. He paid for that one. Oh, man. Big time. Up and down. What a slam. He's absorbed some damage already. He reverses it. Well, that was DDT. DDT. Oh, my God. And that failed to hit the mark. Nice one, Scott. Nice one. Oh, my God. Look at this. Trying to shatter the ankle. Saw that coming. Boom. Down face first. Good in, Aggie. Tangled up, dragon twist cutter, and Mendoza's laid out. That's good. Oh my fucking god, I've hit that twice and it was in the ropes. And dragon twist, dragon twist cutter was sexy as well. Placing them right where they want them into the corner. What a leg drop across the rope. Off the turnbuckles. What's he got? To the sky. Shooting star press. Mendoza is having problems here. Yeah, Mendoza is having trouble. Uh oh, second rope. Best moves oh, ever. That might be the best moves ever. I agree. Took a gamble once. Look out! Splash! You've got to be kidding me. That's a quick like body as a get missile it. over and over again. It's that time. That's going to be it. Amazing execution. Two count. Boom. Finally ends it. And all the bloodshed. Perhaps worth it now. Well, attack and stole one. Here is your winner, Mr. Scott. And with the results of this battle plain to see on their face, at least they can say they won the match. I don't know if I'd say the battle scars were worth it, Cole, but I will say the one who did it to them isn't the one celebrating right now. That match was so difficult. <laughs> Even with Finn Balor getting involved, I was showing I could start and finish fast. That's <laughs> phrasing. <laughs> now I'm ready to do it again and take the NXT Championship. I'm going to be a lot tougher than the last tomato. Can you beat? Can you beat? Enjoy this while it lasts. Your five minutes of fame are about to be up. With a big X. Ooh. Guys, can I capture the NXT title and beat Finn Balor in under five minutes? We will find out next time. I want to say thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please smash that like button if you want to see more WWE 2K22 My Rise. Please don't forget to subscribe. Also, turn notifications so don't miss any of my videos. The wee bell next to my name. Check out, guys. What I know when I upload this next. Yeah, guys, my Twitch, the last video, and all the other videos in this series will be in the description down below. Please check that out, guys, if you want to watch some. In case you missed any. In case you want to watch the last video. Or in case you want to know when I go live on Twitch. Please check that all out, guys. But thank you. Love you all. See ya. Then you win, yeah, I'm sick of being screwed Feel my own adrenaline, yeah, I do just what I do And I hope you let me in, let me in, yeah